Hello YouTubers, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solution and this is tips on how to make your Android phone faster. I want to give a shout out to my cousin on Facebook, D. Lee. He having problems with his Note 3. Uh, Say app was crashing, his browser was crashing, and his phone is very slow. As you can tell with my Darth Vader here, it's very fast and fluid and stuff like that. Well, and this is an older phone. So what I did is three tips I'm gonna show you how to speed up your phone. There's an app in the App Store. You can download this from Google Play. It's called Clean Master. As you can tell, it's called Clean Master. And right now I open the app and it's showing my storage and my RAM. But this uh, button right here that says junk files. And so over time your phone builds up junk files and cache and all kinds of stuff like that. So what you do is you go on and hit the junk file. And what it's doing right now is pulling up all the junk files, everything, all your junk files. And you see it start to turn red. That's a lot. Your phone may have a lot. Right now, I have 401 megabytes of junk. So basically all you want to do is clean it up. All right, so after that's done, you want to go back to your RAM. Boost phone, right here it says boost phone. So right here, basically what I'm doing is I'm just boosting the phone, just gonna make it faster. So this alone will help with your problem and make your phone a little faster. So that's tip one. My second tip for the day is to go into developer's options. So hit your settings, scroll all the way down to about phone, hit about phone, and you wanna scroll all the way down to the, let's say build number. Get this up in the shot build number okay so when you see build number what you want to do is just hit it and it's gonna say just keep clicking it and say you're now a developer okay so you go back and you're gonna have a new something that says developers option okay now what you want to click developer option, you want to go all the way down till you see animation. So what you may see here in Windows animation, you click here to scale. What I usually do is I turn all the animations off. Turn your transition animation off. Turn your all your animations off. And what happens is, see how everything just flies, no problem. Phone runs fast. Okay, so that's the second option. And if that doesn't work, well, let's do a factory reset. Now, I advise you to back up your system. What I mean by backing up your system is you want to get something like a cloud drive or uh, a OneDrive or a Dropbox. Upload all your photos and videos and everything to the cloud. Okay, back your phone up. So what I do is I hit settings and your phone may be, it may be very, since you have the Note 3, uh, you run the TouchWiz. So your touch with has some different options, but it all does the same thing. So basically what you want to do is go into either security or you should have something that says backup or reset. Okay, Let's see if I can get that in a screenshot. Okay, backup or reset. So again, you may have it in security. If not security, then go to backup and reset. So basically all I'm gonna do is click that. 
Now, I have options here. It says back up my data, back up my account, re automatic restore, a factory reset. Okay? Now, if you press for a factory reset, it's gonna give you a warning, let you know that it's gonna erase everything on your phone. Okay? Remember, by doing this, you are erasing everything on your phone. Just like you just bought it. Okay? Now, once you do that, it's gonna come up like you just bought the phone and everything is gonna be a-okay. Again, please leave a comment at the bottom of the screen and thank you very much. Share this video, like my videos. Thank you very much. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, leave, jot me a, down, a comment down below and I'm here to help. Thank you very much. You have a good day. Peace.